Where you at, man? Your house is empty. Ah, uh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert, out by Alamo Sea. All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh, oh, hey, Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Come and drop her! Now bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner, good guy, very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> <sighs> Listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened, and uh, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. Close the fucking uh, business! Uh, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes. Big yeah. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to uh, requisition it. Van. Fantastic. Let's go. Come in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. And watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. <sighs> the weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip, but... Right, let's go! What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. we got to meet them in the air. I, uh, well, OK. Well, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist, giving back the hardware. That was bullshit. Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merriweather networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. <laughs> Hold on. I gotta say. I gotta say, I got him. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, Where's my money, huh? Where's my consultant's fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards and merchandise. I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast from Hove Beach to Vespucci. I want country clubs and a depressed wife with blonde hair and a hot... Whoa! got a plane at the airstrip, if you... Perfect. What you gonna do with a plane? I mean, surely we got... We ain't gonna take Merriweather on the ground. They're a private army, Ron. I, uh, I know what they are. I've been compiling a dossier since the Port of LS heist, knowing you'd want to come back. So tell me, if you're informed, why you think we could take him on the ground? You suicidal, huh? I mean, how do you cope without me? Well, honestly, not that well. You remember before we met? Oh, only too keenly. Straight edge divorcee hiding from the world. You could barely light your own crank pipe. I didn't want to. I mean, I was naturally suspicious of amphetamines. Only after your persuasion, forceful, <laughs> 
Persuasion. Did I see the power as an aid for concentration and deep thought? If I had moved next door, I'd have likely put a gun in my mouth. It ain't pretty, but it's true. Whoa, downer, Ron. Jesus, the world has me to thank for your conspiracy theories. Every hypothesis is theoretical until it's proved. And if we waited around for proof, we'd never get anywhere. Now, let's steal us some guns. Crop duster? That's the best we can do? with my Mexican contact. Tell him we got some guns to sell. I'll get you on the radio. I'll get you on the radio. Yeah, 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 and I'm in a crowd. 
crop duster. This is something I'm acutely aware of. Enough! I'll start monitoring you at that altitude! Flying the high's gonna draw attention! Altitude corrected! here. Bullying, reckless, totally selfish. Do the things that make me me. Like kidnapping the wife of a powerful Mexican gangster and flying a crop duster toward a jumbo jet loaded with mercenaries. Exactly. Everyone's so hung up on appearances in LS, you start to forget who you are. And if you ain't who you are, who the fuck are you? You're the most honest, principled man I know, Trevor. A man of integrity. sure about. When you put it like that... Handle your end, okay?
We got a pilot on board. Come in, air traffic control. There's been a change of personnel and destination on the Meriwether jet. We are now landing in Mackenzie Field. Swapping radio channels. Over. Ron! Ron, you there? I got the jet. You with the buyers? Welcoming party's here, Trevor. Fly safe now.
Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down. I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God. The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Ah, oh, good idea. But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage, the cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear. <laughs>